we are from Kaduna State. And I'm from People's Democratic Party. The party that set up this democracy we are celebrating in 1999. The foundation was properly laid by the People's Democratic Party, upon which other party has sprung up and then they are ruling. Without that, I don't think we would have uh, reach this level of democracy. And as we speak about democracy, we saw a PDP president leaving his seat to allow another party to take over. That is democracy. Yeah. That is democracy. Mr. Speaker, yeah. as we speak about democracy, we thank God for preserving this dear country, Nigeria indeed is not where it ought to be, but certainly we are not where we used to be. And this points clearly about leadership. As we move forward and as we advance as a democracy, there is a need for leadership at every level. Everything rises and falls on leadership. I heard the former, one of the speakers said, Nigeria is rich. Nigeria is rich in resources. Nigeria is rich in human capital. But in management of human capital and resources, there is still a lot that needs to be done in order to move this nation forward. Mr. Speaker, we are glad because of democracy we are standing here. We are glad because of democracy we could speak and our voice is heard. Mr. Speaker, there is still need for freedom in Nigeria. There are parts of Nigeria that cannot go and pray freely. There are other parts of Nigeria that cannot mingle freely. And if we are saying that we are practicing democracy, then there shall be freedom and the same law, constitution, that govern one part of Nigeria should also govern the other part of Nigeria if we are practicing democracy. I want to say, Mr. Speaker, that Nigeria indeed has received and has uh, 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 progressed in many dimensions. But I want to say here that Nigeria needs to provide social security for her citizen, especially as it relates to health and education. Up to this moment, Mr. Speaker, and everyone seated here, one of the greatest challenges and the calls, the text message we receive are borders on health care and education. And I think going forward, Mr. Speaker, Nigeria needs to uh, get her health care system right. Without health, there is no productivity. Without health, there is no Nigerian. Until we get it right in our health sector, we cannot get it right in productivity. Mr. Speaker, moving forward, Nigeria need to have uh, 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 our citizen, poor people, need to be able to access health care without paying from their pocket. Social security need to be in place. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, for this opportunity. And thank, thank you. you for democracy. Thank, thank you, you Nigerians. Much.